Hey, so I just want to talk a bit today about an uh, uh, ultra low power motor that I've been working on. Um, this is really just a version of the Easy Spin motor, which has been uh, you know, made by uh, Laser Hacker and then be reproduced by a lot of other people. I just wanted to give it a try myself. So uh, I happen to have a spool of number 39 wire kicking around, and I wanted to make something uh, just with the materials that I had on hand. So we did a third. Uh, uh, 350 ohms per coil, approximately to 400 ohms per coil on 12 coils uh, around the stator. And I just made a simple um, uh, rotor using uh, magnets that were just dropped into the rotor. I had made a special 3D printed mount for them. And uh, the magnets are all the same. I think they're all north facing out on the rotor. And it's just a very simple uh, needle bearing using a sewing needle and a couple of uh, square head screws. So we're not using a jewel bearing here. Uh, I just really wanted to see, you know, what the power consumption of this would be. And uh, I thought it might be useful for doing uh, low energy experiments, maybe looking at uh, cohering, um, you know, ambient energy from uh, stray RF, that sort of thing. So that's what I've been looking at. So I I'm just going to show a graph of the, uh, the power consumed uh, with voltage here. Yeah, so here's a graph showing the power consumption in microwatts versus voltage. The power consumption is on the y-axis and voltage is on the x-axis. So I found that the motor could be run down to uh, as low as one volt and uh, at that uh, voltage uh, the RPM was pretty low like uh, you know it was, it was it was just kind of barely moving. Uh, but it would only consume about um, 100 microwatts. In fact, I think it went as low as 88 microwatts at 1 volt. And as, as we uh, move up the curve uh, towards 5 volts, then our power consumption went up to uh, over 900 microwatts, but uh, then our RPM, RPM became quite uh, significant. So, uh, you know, a lot of people don't really show uh, how much power is consumed by these little motors, so I thought I would just throw this graph in so, so people could see what was going on with it. This is just an example of the motor running at uh, low speed. This is at 2.5 volts, so the current is about uh, 350 to 400 microwatts, something like that. And this is looking at the 3D printed parts. Uh, we're looking at the stator mount here, basically. And I found that the arm was a bit too low on the original, so I raised it up. So I've redesigned it in my version. Also, if you look at the other printer, this is where I made all the uh, stator mounts for the coils. I also had to redesign them a bit because they didn't quite fit. So I, actually, my motor is about 25% bigger than some of the other ones.